So the first thing we're doing guys, we're going to work on our entry, we're going to club and we're going to come into that underhook and when we come, we're going to try to get as sideways as we can from this guy. So his feet are here, this line guys, that's where I want to be once I get that underhook for this one. So I'm going to get to here guys and I'm going to try to get sideways. I don't necessarily have to make him step to hit this knee tap. If I get out to the side, right when I get in. So I'm clubbing, underhooking, I'm jumping to that side. I'm getting the perpendicular. I mean, it's perpendicular to him. And from here, guys, what I want to do, I want to punch this hand, not so much out, straight up. I want to punch it out a little bit like this. So I'm here, I'm punching this hand up, and I'm running, guys. I'm trying to run right by him. I'm punching and I'm running. And if I do it right, guys, I'm gonna pass, bypass his knees completely and I'm gonna get right to a good side control position. So it looks like this, guys. Clubbing under, as soon as I get to here, I'm running. Look at how I'm falling, guys, to my hip right here. This is ideal. From here, guys, I've passed his guard. I'm here, I can start striking. I can start working my ground and pound. So, so throw it. So as you, so as you, here, as you bring that, as you bring it, just punch back, you step it. And because you're southpaw, because you're southpaw, there's always the, uh, the, the counter hook, you can, you can create a level change also, so it can be here. Up, up. Alright, you're still doing your pivot step, but you're just going to create a level change, just in case something comes at you. Ah. Uh, not bad. You are like, that's not bad. Right. Okay. Don't over roll so you don't get caught with me. Just enough to get underneath that punch if it comes. Beautiful. 